Hi Taurus, Sun Rising and Venus and welcome to your love reading for December 2022. I'll be taking a look at your love interest, how they're viewing you, their feelings and actions they plan on taking. Please keep in mind that this will not resonate with all of you so you're more than welcome to check your other placements. Alright Taurus, let's go ahead and get started. Let's see how this person is currently viewing you. How is this person currently viewing Taurus? Can I just play spirit and clear messages? Their feelings for Taurus, please. What is this person's feelings for Taurus? And the action. The action they plan on taking. All right. So under the deck, you have fear. Taurus, I feel like your love interest is feeling scared to some degree. They could be self-sabotaging. I'm picking up on that energy. All right. But I feel like this person is having some fear at this time. Maybe fear of losing you. Fear of not seeing you, fear of where things could, you know, go or not go. You know, you could be dealing with someone who maybe has a little bit of insecurities. Now, how they're viewing you, you have nostalgia, okay? So I feel like this person is feeling sad for whatever reason at this time, all right? They could also be viewing you as maybe the one that's feeling sad, all right? But for the most part, I feel like this person's feeling sad. They're missing you. Let's dig further. Tell me more about how this person is viewing Taurus. Six of Wands in reverse. The Ace of Cups in reverse and the Star card in reverse. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Aquarius, picking up on Pisces or maybe even a Sagittarius for some of you. I feel that Leo Aries, okay? I feel that right now this person is viewing you as someone who's lost hope in them, who's shut down completely. You're not giving them any attention. You're not giving them any love at this time. You're completely shut down. That's how they're viewing you. Like you've completely lost hope in the situation. You could be ignoring them, all right? You could be pretending like you don't see them, pretending like you don't hear anything they say or keeping them on red for some of you, not viewing their stories, not really seeing what they're up to. Yeah, they view you as someone who's not really paying much attention to them. Pretty straightforward here. And for others of you, they could be viewing you like you've lost feelings for them. You've lost hope in them. Yeah. Now, their feelings for you. Muse. Okay, so this usually talks about painting a new picture. Starting over. Okay, for some of you, this person is wanting to start over with you. Paint a new picture. Start a new story. Let's see. The Temperance. The Justice card in reverse. And the Nine of Cups. Okay. I do feel like this person wants to heal things with you. They want to bring things back into balance. They're trying to see how you two could work this out. Some of you could be dealing with someone that you were either that you're either married to, maybe you had a divorce or there was a separation. And if that's not the case, then this just simply means that things were just not fair in the connection, things were not balanced. You could have been dealing with someone who's very prideful. All right, maybe they get a lot of attention or they're always seeking attention and it's like you got fed up with it. Right now, this person could be acting like they don't care, like they're doing fine just on their own. But in reality, I feel like their life is out of order. I feel like their life is out of place here. A lot of imbalance and like deep down, they want to heal things with you. Yeah, the hair fun here. Some of you are married to this person. Or you talked about it, or maybe you lived with them, or something like that. And for others of you, this is them wanting something serious with you. Wanting to make things official. Some of you could have a child with this person. See, so tell me more. This person's feelings for Taurus. The Magician. Gemini, Virgo Energy, and the Queen of Wands. Yeah, this person's still very much attracted to you. They're trying to manifest you back. But I don't think they're telling you this. Eight of Wands in reverse, at least not yet. They could be acting happy, like, oh, I'm single, look at me. I'm getting attention, a little bit of ego here. Three of Swords in reverse. There could have been a third party situation or a heartbreak. But I feel like this person wants to heal things with you. But again, I feel like their pride is getting in the way. Or 
again, it could be feeling like you're over them or that you don't care. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. They want to offer you something here. And they're feeling a lot of regret and disappointment for how things played out between you two. The actions this person plans on taking, devotion. Hmm, okay. So I feel like this person's going to come in with an offer. All right, let's see. I don't know why that song just popped in my head. I don't know who sings it, but it's like, I don't want to be a player anymore. I don't know why that just popped in my head. Yeah. Actions this person plans on taking towards Taurus, please. Got angels, Holy Spirit, give me clear messages. Actions this person plans on taking towards Taurus. December 2022, Taurus, please. The hangman in reverse. The judgment in reverse. Tell me more. The hermit. Page of wands under the deck. So I do feel like they'll, they will be reaching out. But the thing is that I don't think they're going to like automatically ask for a reconciliation or they're not automatically going to ask for a second chance because i feel like this person has pride or like ego or something like that this person's ego gets in the way tell me more actions this person finds on thinking yeah but look at them they're feeling stressed they're feeling sad regret disappointment depression can't make this up Trapped in their mind, trapped in their thoughts. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Strong, Aquarius, Cancer, Sagittarius, Libra, Virgo. And you're reading Pisces. Tell me more. Action, Ten of Cups. Yeah. I feel like they're going to come forward in a very... For some of you, I will say this person's going to call you or reach out to you crying. I know that sounds dramatic, but that's the energy I'm picking up on. They might call you crying or they might call you very, very late at night. So be prepared for that. I'm picking up on that energy where, you know, they're going to be nostalgic. They're going to be like, remember when we were happy? Remember this? Like, why can't things be like this? And stuff like that. So I do feel like this person's going to, yeah, see two of cups. They might even ask to reunite with you. This person's losing a lot of sleep over you. A lot. They're even struggling financially. All right. They feel left out in the cold by you. But I'm telling you, this person's either going to communicate very late at night or they're going to literally call you crying. Yeah. Over something that maybe was exposed, sneakiness, deception, infidelity. Yeah, the sun card. All right. This person, ton of wands. They're burdened. They're, they're feeling trapped, burdened. Very heavy energy here. And I feel like they're going to want to come forward and make things right with you. But again, are they going to like ask you, hey, just take me back? I mean, maybe. But I feel more like they're going to come and cry or contact you very late at night, like being very nostalgic, um, telling you that they just want, for some of you, they will say that they want marriage with you, that they see you as someone they can be long term with, have children with, all that kind of stuff. But that's what I'm seeing. This person's very stressed out over you, Taurus. Uh, they're losing sleep. I feel like this person has either like, Drastically gained weight or lost weight. I don't know why I feel the need to say that Something like that, but yeah, I feel like this person wants To be happy again with you All right for some of you this could be like them desiring reconciliation Or the goal is to have a relationship Let's go ahead and see what this person wants to tell you Got angels holy spirit. What does this person want to tell Taurus? Can I just Holy Spirit? What does this person want to tell Taurus? Jealousy. I feel like you're. I feel like you've moved on without me, and that's difficult for me to see. Yeah, you see. I feel like this person's very nostalgic. They're jealous because you're not paying any attention to them. Un uh, embarrassed. I know I've acted childishly. I don't know how to approach you now. Exactly. I'm telling you, this person could have like issues with the ego. Sorry, please accept my apology so we can move past this. I'm telling you. I 
obligations. I want to get away from the burdens I have to deal with, but I'm stuck right now. And regrets I should have, could have, and would have. Yep. And foolish. I feel like an idiot for the choice I've made. I wasn't thinking clearly at the time. So, yeah, that's what I'm seeing here for you, Taurus. If it did not resonate, feel free to check your other placements. Thank you to all my loyal subscribers who continue to love and support my channel. And if you haven't already, please like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.